Hello and welcome to Excel-BarTemplates.com. This is a special edition, Excel Pranks. I saw an amazing post on a forum about uh, different Excel pranks you can pull on your coworkers and friends in Excel. Most of them were VBA based, so I thought, well, I wonder if there's something we can do without VBA. But if you have some VBA pranks, certainly send them to me and we can uh, continue the thread. So uh, here's what I came up with for a couple quick pranks um, using just uh, normal settings within Excel. Uh, one, go up to your file and then menu and go to uh, options. Then in options, what you want to do is uh, change your body font to something strange. Uh, I'm going to pick Wingdings. Let's do Wingdings uh, regular. And I'm going to change the font size to 72. It's going to make the whole screen uh, appear really large and have different, uh, no, instead of numbers, it's going to have Wingding information. Then the other thing I wanted to do is customize the ribbon and uh, uncheck all of the different ribbons. Uh, I wish I could uncheck file too, but uh, we can get rid of all those extra ribbons except for the file ribbon. Click on OK. You're going to be required to start your Excel again. Go ahead and click on OK and uh, close out of the uh, file that you're in. Then when you relaunch Excel, what you when you when anytime you create a new blank workbook, this is what Wingdings font 72 is. That's column A. This is column B. They're just massive. There's row 1, 2, 3, 4. Those are the different symbols for Wingdings fonts for 1, 2, 3, 4. There's A. A is the peace sign. Um, and so very strange. I don't have any ribbons that I can choose from. I can write different formulas, but as I do it, I do equals the sum. You can see my formula bars going right. That's a parenthesis, sum of column B, and it's going to give me some number. Let's put in some numbers over in column B, 1 and 2. And uh, just going around anywhere is just uh, horrible. There's a 2, there's a 5, and apparently a keyboard uh, with a chord is the summation of 2 and 5 in Wingdings font, so that's got to be a 7. Uh, so it'll just freak out your coworkers and friends. Pretty easy fix to go ahead and return it. You can just go back into your options, change wingdings back to uh, most likely the very, uh, the third one or second one is body font, and then change it back to your 11 point font that you had before. Add your ribbons back that you had unchecked from before. And once you close and exit Excel, uh, your changes will take effect. Let's go ahead and close that, don't save it. Open up a new blank Excel workbook, and uh, there we are, back to normal. So uh, what other Excel pranks do you have that are out there? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, also, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel, so be sure to get the next great post to deliver directly to your inbox. Thank you.